Dear readers, welcome to our channel. How did the young Duan Luming shine during his high school years at Tongzhong, detonating Professor Guo Guangsan's passion in the optics class and becoming the future star of the quantum information field? What drove him to Los Alamos National Laboratory, leaving behind the honors of academia? In these decisive and miraculous moments, what force propelled him toward the pinnacle of quantum science? Follow the footsteps of this young genius as this video unveils his adventurous journey leading the quantum world. Having studied under Professor Guo Guangshan in the early stages of the development of quantum information in China, Duan Luming made significant contributions. Selected for the Chinese Academy of Sciences 100 Talents program at the age of 29, he became the youngest professor at the University of Chinese Academy of Sciences. Duan Luming's academic career is gripping, with contributions not only in theoretical research but also in practical achievements. For instance, in 2014, his team experimentally verified universal geometric quantum logic gates and their noise resistance, a breakthrough with significant implications for the feasibility of quantum computing. In 2017, his research group set a new international record for quantum storage capacity, achieving an atomic quantum memory with 225 storage units, laying the foundation for quantum storage technology. Duan Luming has been engaged in quantum information research since his graduate studies in 1994, becoming a world-leading scientist in the field. His proposals, such as the DLCZ, Duan Lukin Sirak Zola, Quantum Relay Scheme and the Duan Kimball Optical Quantum Computing Scheme, have laid the groundwork for scalable quantum communication and quantum computing. His quantum entanglement criteria, known as the DGCZ, Duan Giedka Sirak Zola, criteria, have been widely applied in the field of quantum information and included in quantum monographs by U.S. academicians. In 2018, his research group achieved a breakthrough in quantum entanglement by implementing entanglement between 25 quantum interfaces, pushing the previous record nearly sixfold higher. This not only advanced the field of quantum communication theoretically, but also opened up new possibilities for practical applications. Born in 1972 in Tongcheng, Anhui, Duan Luming excelled at Tongcheng High School, a key high school in Anhui province. Influenced by the rigorous academic atmosphere of Tongzhong, he stood out academically, particularly in physics and chemistry. During high school, he participated in the National Olympiads and Winter Camps for Chemistry and Physics, earning him a direct admission opportunity to the University of Science and Technology of China, USTC. In 1998, Duan Luming was selected for the Chinese Academy of Science's 100 Talents program becoming the youngest professor at USTC. This not only brought him personal glory but also served as a vivid example of China's rising research talent in quantum. Information How did Duan Luming form a mentorship with Professor Guo Guangsun during his university years? Colleagues recall that Duan Luming was discovered by Professor Guo Guangsun during an optics class in his sophomore year. Despite being reserved during his undergraduate years, Duan Luming spent most of his time reading advanced scientific literature. One day after class, he approached Professor Guo with an article he had written, seeking guidance. Recognizing the article's somewhat raw but lively ideas, Professor Guo saw Duan Luming as a rare research talent. He warmly invited him to join his research group and participate in weekly seminars. Under Professor Guo Guangsan's guidance, Duan Luming completed his integrated master's and PhD studies. During his doctoral studies, at a time when the field of quantum information was just emerging globally, Duan Luming's strong interest in the field led him to focus on quantum information research. His contributions during those years, with multiple papers published in prestigious physics journals such as Physical Review Letters and Physical Review, garnered widespread international attention. Due to his outstanding research achievements, Duan Luming obtained his PhD one year ahead of schedule and was awarded the 
CAS Director's Special Award in the same year, with his dissertation selected as one of the National Top 100 Excellent Doctoral Dissertations, inspired by Professor Guo Guanzan. Duan Luming turned down the opportunity for a postdoctoral position at Los Alamos National Laboratory in the United States, choosing to continue teaching at USTC. Collaborating with Professor Gui, they proposed error-correcting codes for solving the decoherence problem in quantum information systems, a pioneering contribution. Later, they introduced a new research direction, probabilistic quantum cloning used to study optimal quantum cloning processes. Subsequent papers referred to this as the Duingua limit, representing early influential work in quantum information in China. At the age of 29, Duan Luming was selected for the Chinese Academy of Sciences 100 Talents program, becoming the youngest professor and doctoral supervisor at USTC.in 1998. The pivotal Shangshan Conference for the Early Development of Quantum Information in China unfolded. Duan Luming was invited to give a report on quantum coding at this conference, where he met some crucial peers, especially Pan Jianwei, who was studying quantum information at the University of Innsbruck in Austria. These two young minds at the forefront of quantum information research started exchanging ideas and formed a lasting friendship. Pan Jianwei suggested that Duan Luming visit the University of Innsbruck to broaden his research horizons. The University of Innsbruck, known for international quantum information research, housed renowned figures such as Professor Zielinger, who later received the Nobel Prize in 2022, as well as Professor Zola and Sirak, who received the Wolfgang Prize in 2013. Collaborating with Professor Zola and Sirak, Duan Luming made groundbreaking contributions during his visit, including the widely acclaimed DLCZ Quantum Relay Scheme and DGCZ Quantum Entanglement Criteria.In. 2003, Duan Luming took a faculty position at the University of Michigan, earning the Sloan Fellowship the following year. The Sloan Fellowship is a prestigious award in the U.S. academic community, and many recipients have gone on to win major technology awards, including the Nobel Prize. At the age of 32, Duan Luming was the only one among the Sloan Fellowship winners in the same year who obtained a doctoral degree in China. In 2007, he was awarded a lifetime faculty position at the University of Michigan. In 2009, Duan Luming was elected a Fellow of the American Physical Society, and in 2012, he became the Femi Endowed Professor at the University of Michigan. During this period, his research achievements continued to flourish, particularly in collaboration with Professor Munro, leading their team to become a driving force in the field of scalable ion quantum computing. In 2005, renowned scientist and Turing Award winner Yao Chezhi returned to China and joined Tsinghua University as a professor. Yao Chiji made foundational contributions to theoretical computer science, modern cryptography, quantum computing, and quantum information science. In 2010, sensing the accelerating development of global quantum information technology, Yao Chiji aimed to further promote China's progress in the field. He initiated the establishment of the Quantum Information Center at Tsinghua University dedicated to the research of quantum computing and quantum networks. This endeavor required not only computer scientists, but also world-leading physicists familiar with quantum computing experiments. Duan Luming, with his outstanding reputation in the quantum field, became the ideal choice for Yao Chiji. In the autumn of 2010, Professor Yao Chiji visited the University of Michigan to discuss the future development plan of quantum computing and quantum networks with Duan Luming. Together, they constructed a research blueprint for quantum computing, and upon Professor Yao's invitation, Duan Luming actively contributed to the establishment of the Tsinghua Quantum Information Center. He assumed the role of executive director and concurrently served as the Yao Chiji Endowed Professor at Tsinghua University. Duan Luming quickly established the Quantum Information Laboratory at Tsinghua University focusing on scalable quantum computing and quantum network research. In early 2018, 
he resigned from his position as the Femi Endowed Professor at the University of Michigan, returning to Tsinghua University full-time as the Basic Science Endowed Professor. Professor Duan Luming was officially appointed as the Yao Chiji Endowed Professor at Tsinghua University. At the Tsinghua Quantum Information Center, Duan Luming's research group achieved a series of breakthroughs. In 2014, his team experimentally verified universal geometric quantum logic gates and their noise resistance in solid-state systems at room temperature. In 2017, they broke the international record for quantum storage capacity, realizing an atomic quantum memory with 225 storage units, raising the storage capacity of quantum memory by an order of magnitude. In 2018, they achieved quantum entanglement between 25 quantum interfaces, nearly six times higher than the previous record. In the same year, they combined quantum many-body theory and deep neural networks, proposing the first quantum machine learning generation algorithm, demonstrating the exponential acceleration of artificial intelligence algorithms by quantum computers in some important directions. Recently, Professor Duan Luming led the ion quantum computing direction of a major national research program, achieving stable confinement of hundreds to thousands of ion qubits, and surpassing classical supercomputing capabilities in ion qubit-based quantum simulations, breaking international records in this direction. Throughout these years of research, Professor Duan has published more than 240 papers in renowned physics academic journals including over 66 in physical review letters and main journals, such as Nature and Science, with a total citation count exceeding 36,700. He is like a diligent farmer cultivating the quantum world, continuously sowing seeds in the interdisciplinary field of quantum information, contributing to the realization of the quantum dream on Chinese soil. In conclusion, let's summarize for our readers. Duan Luming's illustrious journey teaches us that genius is not a sudden arrival, but stems from a profound understanding of knowledge and continuous exploration of the field. From his participation in Olympiads during high school to his in depth collaboration with mentors, Duan Luming's growth reflects diligence, perseverance, and a passion for science. We learn that the pursuit of excellence requires persistent effort, regardless of age or background. Duan Luming's decisive choice to return to China for service and pursue higher academic aspirations also teaches us to face choices courageously and strive for ideals. His success on the international stage inspires us to challenge the unknown and surpass ourselves. Ponder, have you encountered moments in life where you needed to sacrifice immediate benefits to pursue higher goals? In fields like science, technology, engineering, Mathematics, are you willing to, like Du and Lumming, strive for excellence? We hope that in this exploration journey, you will also find your own brilliance. Are you ready for the next destination? Today's video concludes here. Stay tuned for the next exciting content. Goodbye. Goodbye. Goodbye.